now we are going to see about a model routing service called not diamond so what is model routing or llm routing when the user asks a simple question the router is going to use the weak ai or weak llm to give you the answer similarly when the user asks a complex question the model router is going to route to the strong ai or strong llm to get the answer in this way we are going to save the cost so when i ask a complex question like this logical and reasoning then it's going to use gpt 40 model because that is considered strong but when i ask a question 1 plus 1 then it's going to respond with gpt 40 mini because that is considered weak model we can route the api call based on the cost or based on the latency i'm going to teach you how you can set up a basic routing like this how to set up model routing in a rag application like this and finally how to integrate that with your own application and set up a user interface like this but before that i have regularly created videos in regards to artificial intelligence on my youtube channel so do subscribe and click the bell icon to stay tuned make sure you click the like button so this video can be helpful for many others like you i've partnered with not diamond to create this video even before they approached me i knew about their service on how this is going to impact cost optimization so first we are going to see basic model routing using not diamond just sign up to not diamond and create your api key from there next in your terminal export not diamond api key like this and then click enter also export your open ai api key like this and then click enter because we are going to use gpt40 model as strong model and gpt40 mini as the weak model so once after you enter your api keys in your terminal pip install not diamond create llama index and chain lit and then click enter not diamond is the main package llama index is for our rag application chain lit is for the user interface after this click enter now let's create a file called app.py and let's open it inside the file from not diamond import not diamond next we are going to set up the client that is not diamond then we need to set the strong model that is gpt40 then the weak model gpt40 mini same like we see here we need to set up a strong model and a weak model to set up routing so next result comma session id provider client chat completions create set up both the strong and weak model here then trade off cost so this will send queries to the weak model when doing so doesn't degrade quality so this optimizes on the cost next we're going to print the provider model and the result that's it you can just do this as a drop-in replacement for your existing OpenAI SDK just by replacing with this code as simple as that now I'm going to run this code in your terminal python app.py and then click enter and here is the response the LLM called is gpt40 mini that is because the question we asked concisely explained merge sort that's a simple question that's why it's using gpt40 mini and here is the answer for merge sort now I'm going to ask a complex logical and reasoning question so the question is Natalia sold clips to 48 of her friends in April and then she sold half as many clips in May how many clips did Natalia sell all together in April and May this is a logical and reasoning question so I'm going to run this code again and here is a response from GPT-40 and the total answer is 72 clips that is correct in this way you can route your LLM calls and optimize on the cost if you want to optimize on the latency just mention in the trade-off latency next we are going to see how you can set up a user interface for this or this could be an example on how you can integrate this model routing in your own application so here is the basic application i've modified slightly from previous code here i created this function called main and then calling this decorator on message by using chainlet that is the main key difference using this you are able to create a user interface which is going to use this not diamond model routing and now i'm going to run this code in your terminal chainlit run ui.py and then click enter this will automatically open the user interface like this now i can ask another logical and reasoning question just because this question is complex is using gpt40 next i'm going to show you about implementing llm routing in rag application so we have just added this part as before when the user asks a question we are going to route the question based on the complexity to reduce cost but at the same time what is rag based on the question we are going to extract relevant information from the vector store and then provide that 
as context to get more accurate answer. So that's what we're going to do. As a first step, we are going to index all the documents, store that in a vector store, that is going to be the local store. Then we are going to ask the question, let the LLM routing route the request to get relevant context to get more accurate answer. So in a file called rag.py, I'm importing not diamond and llama index. So first step, we need to index the document. So I have a file called llama index terms and condition PDF, and here is the file. So I'm going to ingest this document and store that in a vector store. So that's what's happening here. We are reading the document, we are indexing it and storing that in an index. You can even modify this if you want to store that in a separate vector database. But to keep this tutorial quick, I'm saving that in the variable. Next, the user is asking a question and relevant context is passed to get more accurate answer. And here is the question, will my data be used for training? Then we're using that question and searching the vector storage and that will be used as the context. So the context plus the question and with the general instruction, we are going to ask a list of large language models that is OpenAI and also Anthropic Cloud Haiku. So that message is passed here and the trade-off we are giving here is cost. So routing based on the cost. That's it, everything else remains the same. So we index the document, then asking question with the relevant context to these LLM providers. Now I'm going to run this code in your terminal python rag.py and then click enter. And here is the answer from GPT-4 Omini. Generally a rag application is not a complicated application and generally doesn't require a complex logical and reasoning. So I see that it uses GPT-4 Omini here. This is exciting. There are many other features in Not Diamond where you can train your own router, hyper-personalize, join prompt optimization support, hashing and VPN deployments. If time permits, I will cover this in the future. I'm really excited about this. I'm going to create more videos similar to this, so stay tuned. I hope you like this video. Do like, share and subscribe and thanks for watching.